Now, your Super Doppler 10 forecast with meteorologist Jeremy Wheeler. Our temperatures today, uh, you know, when we got in, temperatures were around 50 degrees just a little while ago. So uh, now temperatures, they're going to dip a little bit, and then they'll go back up to low 50s going into the afternoon. So uh, we'll be a little cooler than yesterday, but not too bad. The winds are going to be up a little bit this morning because a cold front's dropping to the south and it's going to stall out. Thing is, well, tomorrow it's going to drop even more south as we uh, sink those temperatures into the upper 40s, and they were near 50 on Sunday, low 50s Monday and Tuesday. So uh, get ready for uh, some steady temperatures, but a little coolness over the weekend. Now, here's the thing. We've got one front that's moving through right now, and that's going to, uh, again, hold our temperatures this afternoon, low 50s. Then this low off to the west is quickly going to ride along that. It's going to zip through, and it's going to create a little bit of precip tonight and early tomorrow morning. Now, the winds are going to be up behind these two fronts. Oh, it's going to drag another front through, uh, by the way. So uh, this morning, as that front sinks to the south, we'll get some gusts maybe up to 20 miles an hour for a little bit. But then the winds this afternoon are not bad. They're out of the east, 5, 10 miles an hour. And then going into tomorrow morning, well, we'll get the winds picking up again behind that low that's moving out to sea already at 7 a.m. So a little bit of gustiness out there tomorrow. Winds could gust up to about 20, 25 miles an hour out of the north. Now, today we're starting off with dry conditions. It will be dry all day. No precip, even though that front is sinking to our south. So we get into 9 a.m. We get into midday, and we're going to see uh, partly cloudy skies, these thin strips of clouds, and uh, winds will be out of the east and northeast. They'll be settling down again later today. So not too bad of a day. I mean, you know, low 50s and partly cloudy, maybe mostly cloudy in a few spots to the south. Now we get into 6 p.m. We're still dry. We're dry up through midnight. It's after midnight when that low comes in. So here it comes. We get a few showers between Richmond and Saluda, rain showers, a little mix north of Richmond. And then, you know, maybe a little bit of a wintry mix for a time up there on the northern neck in uh, Accomack County. But for the most part, this is just cold rain. And even that mix would likely be melting to the north of us because temps will be above freezing at the time and the ground's above freezing. So there it is. By Saturday morning, 8 a.m., it's already out of here. It's a very early system. So most of the day, most of the weekend, most of the day Saturday and most of the weekend is going to be dry. We'll be partly cloudy on Saturday, but those winds will be out of the north. There may be a couple flurries in the morning around the eastern shore, so uh, keep that in mind behind the system. Snow potential, lots of zeros, maybe a little something up there, but even then I think it would be melting Wallops Island over to the northern neck. Check back for updates just in case. There could be some changes, some subtle ones. Wavy News 10 at midday will have those changes. 51 today in Virginia Beach, 54 in Killable Hills, mid 50s south, but low 50s in the metro, partly cloudy, cool and dry. Winds north and east, and the winds will die down later today. Upper 40s in Melpha, Hampton, and Gloucester. 51 Newport News. It'll be chilly with that breeze this morning. Maybe not as bad this afternoon. Boating forecast. There's north, northeast winds 10 to 20. Seas 2 to 3 feet. Small craft advisory on the bay. So uh, tomorrow we got, again, a few showers early in the morning. I couldn't fit the word early in there, but it's very early. So, again, most of the day's dry. Most of the uh, area's dry on Saturday and Sunday. And then, uh, well, we got highs near 50 Sunday, 51 on Monday, 52 on Tuesday. Some, you know, steady temperatures. They go up one degree each day there. 